Hello. So this question number 25 is from IIT Jam 2022. For some real number C, C is within this range, and uh, this is a function phi in this range of uh, open interval 1 minus C to 1 plus C to 0 to infinity. And we have some differential equation, this differentiable function. So these are the two conditions are given phi 1 equal to 1 and y equal to 5x is the solution to this differential equation. So, let's write the differential equation as uh, so we have the differential equation over here x square plus y square dx minus 4xy dy equal to 0. So, we will substitute y equal to vx so dy will be v of dx plus x of dv so substitute y equal to vx we will have x square plus v square x square dx minus 4v x square dy after simplifying we can write it in this way 1 plus v square dx minus 4v write dy v dx plus x dv right equal to 0 from here we can after simplifying we can write it 1 minus 3 v square so v square minus 4 v square 1 minus 3 v square dx minus so in this side it will be 4 vx dv is equal to 0 right so if we divide both side by x and 1 minus 3 v square x into 1 minus 3 v square so so just dx minus dx by x 4 v dv 1 minus so we can write it in this way also just minus 4 v dv 1 minus 3 v square so that is it right so now before integrating so from here we can do one thing this notice that here is 3 v square minus 3 v square so we will have this uh, if we derivative uh, the first derivative so it will be minus 6 v so we can put just 6 over here and make it a plus and minus 6 over here right so now integrate both side ok so what we will get right plus 2 by 3 ln 1 minus 3 v square equal to 0. Oh, sorry, it will be integration constant. So we will write this constant as 1 by 3 ln c. Now, if we do the simplification, what we will get? This, this will it will be 3 if I. So here to simplify it, it will be ln x cube into 1 minus 3 v square whole square ln c right so we can put just uh, v value of v over here so uh, this will be just simplify it this x cube 1 minus 3 y square by x square 
to the power square equal to c right so if we put the same condition over here this we have the condition that phi of 1 equal to 1 so x equal to 1 so this y equal to the phi x we know the solution to this equation then phi 1 equal to 1 so from here we can find that c equal to will be 4 okay So if we simplify it further, we can write it in this way, this. Let it be x cube, x square minus 3, 3, y square whole to the power square by x to the power 4 equal to c so this will just so here we will have this we can write it as also the c x square minus 3 of this phi x phi x whole square to the power whole square to c x so c we have already find the value of c of over here so we can write it directly as 4x okay so if we just rearrange this equation put the this 3 phi x in this uh, way three of phi x minus x square to the power square equal to 4x so this is the solution so let's check with the option so 3 x 5 x square minus so this is in the work case the option is correct option is option b 3 phi x square minus x square So here you have uh, this answer. So the question 26 is saying that for a 4 by 4 matrix, uh, where M is this 4 by 4 matrix in the complex place, we have this M bar, you know the matrix obtained from M by replacing each entry of M by its complex conjugate. So we have a real vector space H. That M belongs to this four by four matrix in the complex plane, and the condition is given that is that M transpose is M complement, this M bar. So from here we can write that. So simply, if we do the transpose of this, so it will be M equal to this m tra conjugate of the transpose okay so what is this so m is a in our case m is a hermitian matrix so what is this hermitian matrix let's recall so this is a complex square matrix so it is a 4 by 4 i have seen that is equal to its own complex conjugate so it can be written as a of i j is equal to j of i so element in the i row and the j -th column is equal to the complex conjugate of the element in the j row and the i -th column okay so this is the hermitian matrix so we can write this in this manner so let's consider so we have the diagonal elements as so h can be written in this form this So first we write the alpha one. So these are the 
diagonal element so how will Hermitian matrix will write this so this is alpha 1 suppose this is a2 plus ib2 a3 plus ib3 a4 plus ib4 similarly here is a5 ib5 a6 plus ib6 is a7 plus ib7 so what will be here this in case of Hermitian matrix it will look like this a2 minus ib2 so it will be a3 minus of ib3 a5 minus ib5 A4 minus IB4, A6 minus IB6, A7 minus IB7. Okay, so this will be the matrix, right? So now we have to find the number of elements over here. Right in the first row, you can see this alpha 1, A2, B2, A3, B3, A4, B4. So there are seven new elements. So for case of alpha 1, it is seven. Okay. Second column, you see alpha 2, A5, B5, A6, B6. So it is five from this second row from here we will find it is 3 this alpha 3 and a7 b7 because these are already known and in the last row it will find 1 so if you sum the total how many dimension it will find so it is the uh, the sum of all total it will give 16 so let's check the option so what is the question it is saying that the dimension of H as a vector space over the real space is equal to the 16. So in our case the option is B, correct option.